for today's headline. Department of Tourism allows leisure travel. Philippine hotels with 2021 TripAdvisor Awards lauded. Tourism recovery priority in planned interregional circuit. The Department of Tourism eased restriction allowing leisure travel. A total of 5,986 rooms from 13 hotels in Metro Manila are available for leisure guests or staycationers. From the National Capital Region and the nearby provinces of Bulacan, Cavite, Laguna, and Rizal, collectively known as the NCR Plus. Subject to the observance of minimum public health standards, the IATF Resolution No. 115A allowed specialized markets of the DOT to operate even while NCR Plus is under general community quarantine with heightened restriction status. The easing of restriction in NCR Plus is good news for our tourism stakeholders. This means more tourism workers will go back to work and economic activities will continue. Needless to say, there is no room for complacency. We would like to remind everyone that the health and safety of our guests and tourism workers remain the utmost priority. These staycation hotels, all of which are star rated, have the capacity and have been inspected and oriented on the new normal protocols to ensure this. Tourism Secretary Bernadette Romulo Puyat added, Department of Tourism Release Advisory No. 5S 2021 on the Operational Guidelines for Accommodation Establishment until May 31, allowing staycation in accommodation establishments that have been granted a Certificate of Authority to operate for staycation. Tourism Recovery Priority in Planned Interregional Circuit An interregional tourism circuit in the Mimaropa Administrative Region and some parts of the Bicol and Calabarzon Region is in the works as part of the government's recovery plan for the battered travel and tourism industry and the Department of Tourism. In the initial discussion among the regional offices of DOT, the identified provinces were Marinduque, Quezon, Laguna, and Albay. No timeline has been provided yet, but the agency said the Center of Fun Tourism Circuit would focus on farm, food, and fate tourism products. Tourism Secretary Bernadette Romulo Puyat revealed the plan during her two-day visit to Marinduque, where she met with local leaders and stakeholders to prepare the province for its reopening for leisure travel. Aside from farm and food tourism, the DOT is also developing a tourism circuit for diving and marine sports on the island. As the results of our most recent travel survey have confirmed, the needs and expectations of tourists have evolved because of the pandemic. To address this, the DOT has been redeveloping tourism products and seeking out new experiences for travelers to enjoy in the new normal, Puyat said. In October 2020, an exploratory dive assessment was conducted in Marinduque's Tres Reyes Island, a popular dive spot where the wreckage of sunken Chinese merchant vessel can be found. It was part of the DOT efforts to pursue dive tourism as one of its priority products identified in Regional Tourism Development Plan. Since last year, the DOT has been finding ways to support the sector and restart tourism safely amidst the ongoing coronavirus crisis. The travel circuit, which evolves destinations that have low or no cases of COVID-19 disease, is among the proposal. Philippine Hotels with 2021 TripAdvisor Awards slotted. The Department of Tourism has slotted local hotels that recently received the prestigious 2021 Travel's Choice Award from TripAdvisor, the world's largest travel destination planning platform. One of the hotels that bagged the 2021 Traveler's Choice Best of the Best Awards is the Manor at Camp Janhe, awarded as among the top 1% of all hotel listings worldwide. Despite changing consumer preferences and new ways of working, the awards also recognize the exceptional service experienced by the visitors amid the pandemic, based on feedback from guests the previous year. Despite the unprecedented circumstances, these local hotels stood out to travelers and provided an amazing experience throughout a difficult year. 
The past year has been very challenging for all our hotels nationwide. Despite the difficulties, our local hotels remain true to their mission of providing exemplary Filipino hospitality to our guests. This local recognition is a testament to the success of the steps we are taking to lessen the long-term impact of the pandemic on the hospitality industry and drive its recovery, Tourism Secretary Bernadette Romulo Puyat said in a news release. Amid the pandemic, the local hospitality industry has committed to putting the health and safety of guests on their topmost priority. Hotel employees work double time to adapt to the challenges brought by COVID-19. These hotels have implemented enhanced cleanliness measures, hygiene protocols, social distancing guidelines, and utilized technology to ensure guest safety. Last March, Boracay's world-famous White Beach made it to the 12th spot in El Nido Palawan Nakpan Beach Rank 18 on the TripAdvisor Traveler Choice 2021. Best of the Best Awards, Top 25 Beaches, Asia Category. And that's all for our latest news today. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you want to see more of this content. Thank you so much, guys, and I'll see you on the next one.